is up everybody, Zeusidus here. Today I'm going to show you how to increase your bass on your stereos or headsets with Windows 7. It possibly could work with Windows 8 or 10. Um, <clears throat> so I'm going to show you how to um, increase your bass and your sound quality. And also like virtual like 3D sound. So first what you gotta do is go to the speakers logo, click on the picture. So as you see here you have your speakers properties. So you wanna go to enhancements and you wanna go to bass boost. So as you see I have it selected and after you select it, you go to bass boost settings. So if you really want good quality bass, I recommend setting it to 3 dB because this is pressure. Of uh, this is what what the pressure sounds like. So if you put it to 6 9 12 or above, it's going to sound lower and it will sound even more equal to the bass. So it will sound like less bass and it won't it'll be like there's no bass at all. So I recommend setting that to dB but not none because the none sounds terrible. And 3D, uh, 3 dB is perfect, and you can set this to set this to how high you want. I had it on 600, but I recently changed it to 125, cause 100 and like the lower ones, like under 100, actually um <clears throat> have like this. It sounds like bass, to be honest, and this is like really just high pitch sounds, and this is like low pitch sounds. So I'm going to change that to a 75. <coughs> so what you can do, you can preview. I put chimes on and your apply. So virtual sound is basically, it, it, you can have speakers, but it's like if you have a headset, it will make it sound like it's surround sound, but it will make it sound a lower quality. Room correction, this is if you actually have speakers itself like speakers and like it says room correction compensates for room and speaker characteristics which I've never used this and loudness equalizations it basically just drops the volume even if you have it on 100 it's gonna sound lower than it did before and I guess that's like help your hearing <coughs> so what you can do is you can click every one of these click settings and all that stuff and you can click restore defaults if you want. So when you go in here, the, the, this is self-explanatory. This because I, I cannot use this because it acts like my headset is speakers because I, I'm using, I recently hooked up my PlayStation 3 headset to my computer. Okay. So it treats it like speakers. But what you want to do is you want to change the sound quality and put it to the one at the bottom the very bottom one which is going to be the highest which is studio quality which will make it sound spectacular cl clear quality so that is what you want to put it on so levels levels really is, is just this right here that's levels and balance is like if you want your left ear to be um, louder or you want your right ear to be louder or less loud than the other ear, and that's what you can do. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna click apply once you change those settings. So this is a basic tutorial on how to increase bass boost, um, sound quality, and um, virtualizations and room corrections and loudness equalizations. So thank you for watching, and see you next time.